Hi, praise the Lord. Uh, you're very welcome for your daily devotion by Apostle Grace Tulega. I would like to wish you a happy new year. You're very welcome to 2022. I'm so excited for this year. Today we're reading from the book of Jeremiah, chapter 33, verses 3, and it says, Call to me and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things, fenced in and hidden, which you do not know. Do not distinguish and recognize, have knowledge of and understand. Praise God. Our theme today is talking with God. There is a difference between talking with God and talking to God. Most people spend their time in prayer talking to God, bombarding Him with their grievances, needs and problems. Even if God were to try, He cannot get in a word address because the Christian is so busy talking. Because true and effective prayer is based on a relationship, it cannot be a mere monologue. You must give God the opportunity to speak, praise God. This is a lesson I learned many years ago, Apostle Grace says. There was a time I prayed about the same issue over and over again, yet in vain. One day the Lord asked me, have you actually consulted me about this issue? This question gave me pause because I suddenly realized that I had not asked him, and neither had I taken time to listen to his response. When he eventually told me what to do about the matter, my greatest regret was how much time I had wasted talking instead of listening to what God had to say about the issue. Praise God. Our theme scripture clearly reveals to us that God is very interested in talking with us. He wants to reveal to us the great and mighty things. Praise God. He wants to discuss purpose and destiny with us when we pray, not merely to be a receptacle for our list of needs. Praise God. In Deuteronomy chapter 4 verses 36, the Bible says, Out of heaven he made thee to hear his voice, that he might instruct thee. God wants you to hear his voice so that he can instruct you. Praise God. In prayer, you must remember that God wants to speak to you too. Be more eager to listen than to speak. Our father studies from Deuteronomy chapter 4 verses 36 and Ecclesiastes chapter 5 verses 2. The golden nugget says there is a difference between talking with God and talking to God. In prayer, you must remember that God wants to speak to you too. Be more eager to listen than to speak. Praise the Lord. Let us pray together. Loving Father, I thank you for this truth. You have said in your word that you cause me to hear your voice, that you may instruct me. Today, my heart is open not just to your voice, but to your instructions. Even in your silence, I hear instructions because you have taught me how to listen to you. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray and believe. Amen. Stay tuned for your daily